Hi there, I'm J.W. Rinsler, and we're here at Skywalker Ranch Art Archives. I'm here with Roger Christian, who was set decorator on the first Star Wars film. One of the iconic guns will be Han Solo. I'm Captain of the Millennium Falcon. George kept saying he wanted a Western, because then I found this, which is right. the Mauser. I found a silencer, which I stuck on the front. So I thought, if anything represented a, a cowboy gun for the future, that's it. <laughs> So George, he took one look at this. I could see he just smiled. From that moment, he knew I was doing what he wanted. This is a sterling basis. Mm -hmm. I love the shape of this. And I thought, if I could convert that to the stormtroopers, this would have flame at the end and smoke, and it would go boom, and it would look real. Did the shells fall out of that? The yeah. shells came out. Yeah. That, that, in the end, caused a problem shooting, because these are made with a left hand. You see, I'm left-handed, so to me, that was natural. But if you're right-handed, when they were firing, they were hitting. <laughs> <laughs> if you look at the stormtroopers, they actually are working Mostly this way. left-handed. Yeah. yeah. So I found one of these, and I'm pretty sure it was from a kind of medieval armor. We stuck that on the end, mm -hmm. and that became the, the gaffy stick. So I had to make mold rubber ones so they could use for the fight. I know Mark Hamill was pretty scared. And I knew, reading the script, that this lightsaber was Excalibur. So I knew it had to be special, and I couldn't find anything. And then one day, I pulled out this box, opened the top. Your father wanted you to have this when you were old enough. As there were about seven or eight Graflex handles, and I saw this and just went, oh, my God, and called George, and that was it. What is it? Your father's lightsaber. This is the weapon of a Jedi Knight. Layla French, lead archivist, made a great discovery the other day. Hey, Layla. Hi, Roger. <laughs> great to be here. Every now and then we find these sort of what I consider lost artifacts of Star Wars, and when this piece fit into the handle, we went, aha, we have found the original lightsaber. Yeah. Those are them. The first time it fires up is when Obi-Wan Kenobi gives it to Luke. And we painted it with blue projection material. You've got a light on it, it glows. If you strike me down, I shall become more powerful than you can possibly imagine. I'd like to thank you, Roger, for coming here. Thank you. Give a nice Jedi pose. <laughs>